Hi there, this is Tina Hughes from buildawebsitetonight.com. In today's quick web video, I'm going to answer a question from one of my subscribers named CJ. CJ writes, Hi Tina, thanks for the tips. I would appreciate it if you can direct me on how to add my company name to my WordPress website if you can. Thank you, CJ. Okay, this is a great question, CJ, and yes, I can help you. What I'm going to do is pop over to my demo site and show you how to do this. Okay, here's one of my demo sites. Up the top here in this WordPress theme, which is just the generic theme, I've got a heading that says Easy to Understand Website and Internet Training. Now, this is where your website name would normally appear, and that's easy enough to set that up. So let's go in and see how to change that text at the top of your website. Now that I've logged in, I'm inside the dashboard for this particular website. Here's the name as it appears here in the top left-hand corner. To change this, we need to go into the Settings area. So down here on the left-hand side, there's an option called Settings, and if I click on that, I can see more options. If I click on the word general, that will take me into the settings screen. Now here is where I can change it. This is what currently appears. If I change this to um, demo site, we'll build a website, oops, tonight.com. Okay, if I change that and then I scroll down, I click the save changes button. Once that's saved, I get a message at the top that says settings changed. I can then pop over to the live page and we'll refresh that. Okay, here's the live page. This is the current heading. Now to refresh this, I'm going to do Command R or Apple R on a Mac. You can do Control R on a PC. So let's press that. Oops, press the screen first and then press it. Control R and there we go. That heading has now changed. So this is where you can put the name of your website. Now this of course is on the generic theme, on the 2010 theme and it's the same for the 2011. It will depend on the theme that you use. If you have chosen a theme that you have installed, it may be that that particular theme has another way to deal with this. Let me just pop back into the dashboard and I'll show you. In the dashboard, if you have installed another theme, it will appear here under the Appearance option. Right now, these are just the generic options that come with the website when you first install it. If you've added a new theme, it quite possibly will have another link in here linking to the options for that particular theme. If you can see something like that, click on it and then over here in this part of the screen you should see things that you're able to change through your theme and it may be that something has been set up. Again, this differs from theme to theme. So I can't really say what it's like for the theme that you have. I don't know the name of it and I'm, I'm familiar with a lot of themes but there are thousands of them out there. Okay, I hope this has been helpful. I hope you're able to change the company name on your WordPress website. Do get back to me and let me know how you get on. Okay, that's it for this week. If you would like to sign up for my newsletter, Your Biz Hot Tips, where you get a web video tip of the week. Sometimes it's not every week. Sometimes I'm a, a bit late with my delivery, but um, I am thinking of you. So if you would like to sign up, here's the link at the bottom of the screen here, buildawebsitetonight.com slash newsletter dot html okay this is tina hughes saying cheerio from builderwebsitetonight.com and your biz hot tips